Dancing on my innocence, yeah, body on my Finding on my innocence, yeah, body on my Losing on my innocence What flavor of peanut did we get? Uh... Like I said, this is gonna be kind of boring, so I apologize. However, it is very How's your shoulder been feeling? Good. That's it, right there. So YouTube, what we're doing is we have uh, assisted dips, then we take it over into an actual bench dip. And Kelly, we're doing supine. Remember the supine? That's right, so 30 of those. So what we're gonna be doing uh, YouTube is she's actually gonna be pushing her hips up. Now the reason uh, we do this is one, it just work a little bit of core, a little bit more core, so that's gonna be number one, however, the biggest part of it is you have a higher contraction on your tricep. So these are so much harder to do because uh, as your hips go up, the angle changes. So your tricep has a high, the highest contraction point or peak contraction at the very top. And you work some glutes too. Hey, you know Kelly? You don't like those, do you? I've gotten better. She has gotten so much better. So much better. Good. Down and up. Good. You can actually see how the contraction of the tricep goes a little bit higher, um, but the biggest thing is you'll feel it. You'll <laughs> you'll feel the difference. You can tell you can tell a big difference between the two, right, Kelly? Yes. Like hands down. Yeah. 
Good morning, you guys. Welcome to today's video. I'm starting it in my bedroom today, which I feel like is super weird. I, ju I just feel like all my videos are starting to look the same, and I like start them in the same locations and then in the same location. So we're switching things up today in my bedroom. And I made the bed because I'm team. Gotta make the bed in order to feel like my house is clean. Not apartment. It's definitely not big enough to be considered a house. But um, it's already like 11 o'clock. I'm gonna head over to my dad's. I am selling some stuff on Poshmark, which actually I guess I should mention on here. Oh, <laughs> hey ladies. They look good over there, don't they? Hopefully we'll add to the collection this coming year. But um, I'm selling stuff on Poshmark. I have like four pairs of jeans on there. I'm probably gonna post another pair. And I don't think many people are seeing them because it says size two, which if you've ever tried on Express jeans, you know that they run big. At least that's what I found. Like I'm not a size two. No. Um, so I normally wear a size four in all leggings. I'm normally like a 26 in jeans. Gosh, I don't know, I never wear jeans. <laughs> I think I'm a 26. But the jeans just don't really fit me that well anymore. They always gap on my stomach. They fit my butt kind of, but yeah. So regardless, they say they're twos. They really fit like fours. And they're, most of them are like barely worn. Most of them are barely worn. Or with they were ever worn at all. Someone bought a sports bra that I have posted on there, so I have to go ship that out. But if you guys are looking for jeans or anything, there's also like a blazer on there that I've never worn before from Express. It's just too tight on my back. Like, I feel like if I were to go like this, I would like bust out of it because wide lats, you know what I'm saying? It's a cool problem to have, but I'm like, cool, this blazer was like super expensive and I can't wear it. So that's on there. There's some other stuff on there. I'm going to keep posting more. I have this, I don't know if it's Lily Pulitzer. That's not the brand. I have this really cute little pullover that was like a hundred some bucks that I've never worn before. So I think I'm going to post that. But any hoozy, we're going to head over there, get that shipped off, say hi to Bud. And it's like gorgeous out today. It's cold, but Bright blue skies, the leaves are finally starting to change because the temperature dropped. We might take him on a little walk. I need to go to Kroger. So it's gonna be a good day. Then we're gonna read. I also got an email, I signed up for like, or not signed up, but told them it was okay to send me regular emails, um, basically of like continued education. I'm getting my certification through ACE. And so I get emails normally like once a week over just different topics and new studies. And I got an email today over little workouts you can do at your office to help with posture and mobility and like helping to fix normal problems you get from sitting down all day. So let me know if you're interested in that. I might do a whole little video or start doing like training tip Tuesdays or something like that. Let me know if you'd be interested in that. I think that would be kind of fun to share. Um, and I feel like that's something, even if you're not working at your, or even if you're not working in an office, it definitely still affects a lot of us because we're sitting, like I'm sitting most of the day now at my computer, answering emails, checking in with clients, writing programs, editing YouTube videos. So I sit down most of the day and I constantly have to like, think like, okay, no, stop like hunching over. I have to focus on fixing my back posture, but there's just some certain things you can do to help with hip mobility and all that. So let me know if you're interested. Let's head to my dad's, like I've said like 20 times. I've been talking for four minutes. What's wrong with me? Okay, well, I dropped off the package I needed to at the post office, but of course, Bud's not here. So I was like waiting here. I cleaned my dad's place, vacuumed, got the glass cleaner out, cleaned the tables, cleaned off his TV stand. I'm like, all right, Bud's gotta be here soon. An hour went by and he's still not here. So he probably went to work with my dad and I've just been sitting here like an idiot. <laughs> 
me. I love seeing the little guy, and I know you guys do too because he's so freaking cute. But now I'm starving, it's 12.30. I need to eat something. I've had my frozen mocha smoothie with peanut butter, and I had a half a scoop of oatmeal, so one serving of oatmeal um, with a couple of chocolate chips because it's so good. And yeah, so, so now I'm really hungry. Hungry to the point where I don't really feel like going grocery shopping first because then I would have to make food. So that's like another hour and a half, hour ma or hour minimum till I can eat. So I think we're just gonna have to go somewhere. Maybe beef it, Chipotle, Panera. What else is around here? What can I get? I don't know. We're gonna figure it out. <sighs> Bummed I didn't get to see Bud but we'll come back and see him later. the next day Christopher and I I was reading most of the day yesterday and then he got home we were gonna go get beef it get my pizza and the line was ridiculously long so we got Chipotle I made bomb protein waffles like I always make protein waffles at night but I got these little Reese's peanut butter Reese's chips instead of the chocolate chips added some of those in there it was really, really good. Um, but yeah, drinking my frozen mocha smoothie. I don't know why, because it's they just got done saying it's below freezing outside right now. <laughs> Hence why my nose is all red. Um, yeah, that's gonna be it for today's video. I think I'm gonna do a full day of eating today, so that will post tomorrow. And then the video after that is gonna be a very fun one. We're gonna see Amanda. We're gonna go to the Phil Collins concert. It's gonna be great. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Um, oh, I think I'm gonna take on a few more clients. So if you're interested, send me an email, k underscore Jaeger at yahoo.com and let me know if you're interested. We can chat. See you guys tomorrow.